esse estudo é de que parte do corpo? Ok, this is an MRI of the shoulder. The specific image you are pointing at is a coronal view. Quais são as principais alterações que você observa neste estudo? In this MRI, the most significant finding is the increased signal intensity in the rotator cuff tendon. This suggests the possibility of a tear or tendinosis. Especificamente nesta região que eu estou apontando, o que você observa? In the region you're now pointing to, which is the acromioclavicular joint, there appears to be some increased signal intensity and possibly some bone irregularity. This could be indicative of inflammation or osteoarthritis. Pres... Gostaria de saber se há presença de derrame articular. I do not observe significant fluid accumulation within the joint space. Therefore, there is no clear indication of a joint effusion in this image. E esta obliteração, esse edema pericapsular no recesso axilar, o que você acha que pode ser? All right. The pericostalar edema that you are pointing out in the axillary recess could suggest inflammation around the shoulder joint capsule. This could potentially be related to capsulitis or other inflammatory processes. Você pode me ajudar criando o relatório? I can certainly assist in creating a report by summarizing the key findings. The image shows a shoulder MRI with some abnormalities, including increased signal intensity in the rotator cuff tendons, suggestive of a potential tear or tendinosis, there are signs of bone irregularity and signal increase in the acromioclavicular joint, suggestive of inflammation or osteoarthritis, and there appears to be peritosteoarthritis and the axillary recess, suggestive of capsulitis or other inflammatory processes. Obrigado. You're welcome. Is there anything else I can assist you with? <laughs> Incredible.